after two years uh, of pandemic, this is the first in-person event that Yan Feng has had, uh, and we decided to have this event at Plug and Play uh, because Plug and Play has been a wonderful partner, uh, and we thought this was the the best location in the country for uh, such an event to happen. Uh, we are very optimistic that this is just a passing uh, chapter and pretty soon uh, plug and play. The building is going to be full of people again and this will be the most exciting uh, space, uh, innovation space to be uh, if you are an automotive. Some of the events that we have done in the past, uh, we've either done in an auto show setting, so like Detroit Auto Show, um, or we've done it through what we've done here with the mobile trailer event. So it was a very specific YF-centric uh, discussion, obviously, but one of the things that I think Plug and Play offers is such a wide variety of uh, startups, as well as customers and automakers who know of Plug and Play and what technologies are cultivated here. And then that builds excitement as well that ultimately helps us get new eyes and new people and new experiences in the room so we can then share what we offer to them and understand if there's opportunities to work together more. One of the, the most obvious ones is uh, what we've done with MEMS technology and Next Input. Um, and we've, uh, there were a number of different ways to provide uh, the solution. Uh, MEMS technology and Next Input had the, the best uh, approach and we uh, basically won business together at, at uh, an important customer for us. So that's a, uh, certainly a win. There's no better place to be than Silicon Valley in, in our view because this is where so much of that change is happening. It's really being driven from, it's being challenged by what's going on here. And so plug and play specifically is really, you know, put a flag there and say, that's a great place to, to find out what's going on, to be part of what's going on and to help lead that, that change in the industry.